morning guys. I've left VidCon in Anaheim and driven up to Pasadena today. Today's vlog is sponsored by Intel and they've invited me to be part of a really exciting project they're doing with a bunch of influencers from around the world. And we're gonna be meeting with them and their marketing team to learn about the new Intel i7 8th generation processor. And I'm gonna be getting a two-in-one laptop today to test out, see how the processor performs when I'm trying to edit 4K video. And yeah, hopefully in the meeting today, just learn a bit more about why processors are important and uh, what it enables you to do and me to do as a creator trying to make cool videos on YouTube. Let's go in. we just come up to the roof. Sarah's here. Hey. Hi, what's up guys? It's been a minute. Joining me and Sarah is Austin. We just met. When did you fly in? I actually live like... Oh, okay, okay. So he just came to join us and we're about to have a presentation about this campaign, this project. Um, you know, we do kind of influence our things in pockets, but we've never had a like centralized, concerted kind of global effort to say like, how can we change how we're marketing to reach our audience more directly in a, in a more authentic way? So this is the beginning of what we're hoping is a lot more of this kind of real storytelling product in the wild, product being used, showing the usages that we talk about all the time, bringing it to life. Um, and I feel like, like we're starting something that we're hoping can be um, a lot bigger. I think we talked a little bit earlier, we're calling it the Innovator Program, but right now that is really just sort of internal name. I don't think we have any We can put fun in it. It has an eight, because yeah. I told Sarah it's eight gen. <laughs> is that like you don't... <laughs> Is that like you don't want us referencing that name in on our videos, or you don't you mind? Could. You guys will be the judge. If you guys hate it, if you guys hate it, we scrap it. Guys, do you like this name for the program? Innovator. We could do like an Avengers trailer. Yeah. Where we have like, we're the innovators. <laughs> Let's do it. Uh, uh, yeah, that's that's a great idea. I've got to say, I am very impressed with this office space. This is one of the coolest office spaces I've seen. This room, particularly, this, uh, this little boardroom. Is this, is this electric? Yeah. Oh, cool. It's, it's, Are you gonna ride it? Yeah, I've never ridden one of these before. What is this? Oh yeah, sure. It's been a really fun morning with the Intel team. I've been given my two-in-one device. I've quickly come back to my hotel room to set it up, install some of the software I usually use, like Photoshop, Lightroom, Premiere. Let's check this out. So this is the HP Spectre 360 with a 4K screen, 16 gig of RAM, a terabyte solid state hard drive, and obviously the Intel Core i7 8th generation processor. And similar to other two-in-one devices I've had before, you've got laptop mode, and then you can flip it around to full tablet mode. And you can also put it in tent mode. Oh. Um, yeah, it flips around there. There's a stylus. I'm looking forward to playing around with this stylus more. Something I've been wanting to do is learn calligraphy. And then back to laptop mode. So yeah, it's been really cool today learning about Intel and the benefits of their 8th gen processor. Some of the benefits are that it's much faster at multitasking. And I usually have multiple windows open, different software running, whether it's Premiere, making thumbnails in Photoshop, probably editing my Instagrams at the same time in Lightroom. And uh, yeah, this can handle all of that. Plus when I'm browsing on the internet, I often have like a million tabs open, um, multiple YouTube videos I'm flicking between. It's also built to handle the latest high-end software and I'm gonna put it to the test later on by editing this vlog in 4K and I'll give you a full lowdown. We've collected Raya and we are heading now to the Griffith Observatory, which is apparently it's closed on a Monday, but it's still an amazing view over LA. We're gonna do a little photo shoot, like do some Instagrams. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try out the two in one. Oh 
I've had to back up because I've got the 85 for the focal length, but this is pretty cool with Raya and the Hollywood sign behind. been to the Griffith Observatory you have to come here guys this is like the number one place to get a beautiful view over LA so this is it it's this massive telescope up there and then check this view out I've been here a few times um, I think I first came here in 2013 when I first came to LA this is cool isn't it yeah my favorite spot in LA, I think. Yeah. Wow, this in Venice. Yeah. <laughs> Behind the scenes of an Instagram. Yeah. This is how the magic is made, guys. You make it look so easy on Instagram, it's just like, yeah, we just took a photo. <laughs> I threw it on there. It's like, like 200 shots to get the right one. I mean, not like down, Wait, down. Wait, you're a YouTuber. Yeah. Okay. What's your name again? Louis. <laughs> See, the thing with these guys is they're so famous that you can't really get any work done. They just got people coming up to them all the time. Okay, part of this campaign is showing how mobile this two-in-one device is. So I brought it out with me. I'm gonna try and edit some of the Instagrams out whilst we're chilling. Unfortunately, the cafe's closed. That's where we were gonna chill and have a coffee, but... We're gonna make this work. Anyway, I need to get a thumbnail for this video, so I'm thinking we're gonna pose in front of the dome here with the Hollywood sign behind, and I might do some cheesy pose with the laptop. Um, <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. This is pretty nice lighting right now. It's, it's approaching golden hour. This is, this is pretty nice, this is pretty nice. Okay, I'm gonna throw some of the photos we were just taking onto the laptop and play around in Lightroom, see if I can do some editing. Sunset is awesome, guys. I just got some bangers on the 85 of Raya. <laughs> Definitely one of my top sunset spots in LA. Okay, sun is set. We're heading to dinner now. Then we're going to eat at Sage back in uh, Pasadena. This is so pretty. Okay, our starters have arrived. Guys, this is vegan calamari. It's made of coconut. This is awesome. Then I've got some Brussels sprouts and some dal soup. How good is this I vegan not, calamari? I keep eating it and I can't believe it's coconut. I've got my after dinner coffee. And we're just looking through some of the photos we took earlier. Oh. What the heck? One. Why is your hair going off on an it's adventure? Just one. The rest of it's fine. It's like properly going off on an adventure. <laughs> Raya said she likes her swooshy hair in this one. <laughs> that is swooshy. <laughs> Any of these in focus? <laughs> They're all out of focus. So we'll find one, we'll find one. Yay! I'm <laughs> what am I doing with my eyes? <laughs> what am I doing? Oh. Oh, hello. <laughs> Guys, we've found the one. We have found the Instagram. That's it. That's the perfect natural pose. Perfect. <laughs> Guys, this sums up our relationship. <laughs> no. Yes. No. Yes. 
right, we're back at the hotel. I've been editing the vlog from today for a couple of hours in 4K on this machine. And I am really impressed. I honestly thought because it's a two-in-one device, it would lose performance, but it really hasn't. And you can flip it and use it as a tablet like we were earlier over dinner, like having fun swiping through photos. So yeah, I'm really impressed with the eighth generation Intel processor. It's noticeably faster and handles 4K video much better than devices I use with previous generation processors from Intel, like my MacBook Pro or the XPS 15 that I was using last year. I wanna show you quickly how it handles 4K. So this is full resolution and I'm scrubbing in the timeline and there's no glitching, it's super fast. So I've been dragging these 4K clips in and uh, yeah, it's just a much faster process being able to do this um, and not having to deal with the lag like I normally do. I also tested the render time earlier and render time is really important to me because I'm rendering my vlogs every day. I'm having to rush and get them uploaded and stuff. So again, really, really impressed with how fast it renders 4K video. And lastly, although I've been doing a lot of intensive editing in 4K, the battery life has lasted a lot longer than I'm used to. Usually I can't edit an entire vlog on one battery. I have to plug it in, which gets difficult if I'm flying and planes don't have power sockets and stuff. So if you wanna learn more about this particular laptop or other two-in-one laptops powered by the Intel Core i7 8th generation processors, check the links below. And in the near future, I'm gonna do an update vlog letting you guys know how I'm getting on doing all my vlog edits on this laptop. Right, I'll catch you tomorrow. Peace out, enjoy life, and live the adventure. Boom.